there to play. Hi, I'm Nancy Drew. This is my center of operations, my desk. Go ahead and poke around. If you want to know the particulars of how I do what I do, take a look at the book titled How to Be a Detective. It's real helpful, especially if you're new to the mystery solving business. And be sure to check out my scrapbook. I put memorabilia from all my past cases in there. A lot of them were pretty dangerous and at times really scary. But don't say anything about that to my dad, okay? He worries about me enough as it is. And whatever you do, read what's in the file called Case File. That'll tell you all about the mystery I'm about to try to solve. If you think you're ready to dive into that mystery, just click on the plane ticket and you'll be on your way. Dear Dad, who would have dreamed taking a vacation to visit Aunt Eloise in Florida would result in another case? Seems a student named Jake Rogers was murdered at the high school last week. And an undercover police detective wants me to pose as a student to search for any leads at the school. So it's undercover I go. I'm calling this case Secrets Can Kill. Love, Nancy.
something to make this work.
Nancy Drew, Detective Beach here. How are you? Good, and yourself? Frustrated, Nancy. I need some leads, and you're my man. Uh, well, woman, teen, student, whatever. I'll be at Maxine's diner. Come see me when you've found out anything. All contact should be through me. Can do. So what's our cover? Our what? Um, our cover. Who should I say you are if anyone sees us and asks? Oh, right. Uh, I'll be your uncle. Uncle Steve. I gotta go now. If you need anything else, come see me at Maxine's. I'm wearing glasses and a green striped shirt. I need more money. Uncle Steve! Nancy! Why, I haven't seen you since... Uh... uh for a long time! <laughs> How's your... Aunt. Aunt Eloise. Oh, she's fine. And Dad says hello. You're staying with your aunt, right? Yes. So, uh, what do you got for me? Well, I was hoping you could debrief me on the investigation. Oh, sure, sure, sure. I'm just a bit... Well, my undercover assignments are usually not so... Uh, suburban. I understand. The victim was a senior named Jake Rogers. As usual, none of the family, teachers, or students know about any enemies he may have had. Nothing came up from searching his home, computer, cell phone, or locker. His bank records tell a different story. He had a fairly large savings account and a lot of cash deposits. We suspect he was involved in something shady. Drugs, gambling, or blackmail. That's where you fit in. Talk to the students and see what you can find out. We think he might have kept information about his activities in a notebook or journal. So keep a lookout for anything like that. Anything else? Goodbye. Goodbye.
Whoa, a new girl at school. Do you realize what destiny has brought you today? Yours truly, Hector Sanchez. But you can just call me the Hulk. How did you know I was new here? Hey, you're talking to the man, the number one football player in the state of Florida. I know all the beautiful girls at Paseo Del Mar High. Are you kidding? Who do you play for? You are new around here. I play for the Manatees. One of the best teams in the state. I leave the others in the dirt, man. Soon it's college ball, and then the pros. Showtime. Who are the manatees? Paseo Del Mar's mascot is a manatee. Don't tell me you're afraid of a little sea cow. Well, uh, actually, I'm afraid of them. Aren't they really dangerous? You're not from Florida, are you? There's nothing to be afraid of. Manatees are the friendliest underwater sea cows around. I've been trying to get the coach to change that lame mascot ever since I first made the team. Is there anything you're afraid of? Me? When I walk down the halls, it's punks like Jake Rogers who fear me. Are all football players as aggressive as you are? You have to be aggressive if you want to win. That's why I'm the best. Is there anything else I can enlighten you on? So, what's been going on at school lately? Somebody killed Jake Rogers. Jake Rogers? I knew Jake, but I didn't hang out with him. Uh, sorry, can't talk now. I gotta go to practice. Later. Hi, my name's Nancy Drew. What's your name? 
Hal Tanaka. Actually, my first name is much longer than that. But I want to fit in here in America, so I chose Hal as my nickname. I'm a Japanese exchange student. Why do you think it's easier to have an American name? I want to be part of the culture and succeed in this country. So, what's been going on at school lately? A murder was committed here. Everyone is very stressed out. I heard about that. Some kid named Jake? Oh, yeah. Jake Rogers was a dark soul. He created a lot of trouble. What kind of trouble? Jake was an Ijimeko. In English, you would say a bully. He wasn't very popular. I'm behind in my studies and I must get back to the library. Bye, Nancy. Do you know the combination to Jake Rogers' locker? I'm sorry, Nancy. I can't help you with that. Have you heard of Hulk Sanchez? Heard of him? Hulk holds the conference record for quarterback sacks. He's been the state's number one player since he was a freshman. He's also a candidate for a big university, even with his injury. Injury? Hulk got hurt a few weeks ago. Ever since that game, he hasn't played the same. I worry that his chances of playing for a top school are not as good as before his injury. See ya! Farewell, Nancy. Bye. I must go now, Nancy. Hi, I'm Connie. You're not from around here, are you? Usually, Paseo del Mar High is really quiet and boring. Lately, it's been totally out of control. Out of control? One of the students was killed last week. What happened? I think he was pushed down a flight of stairs or something. What makes you think he was pushed and didn't just fall? I heard his face was all messed up, like he was in a fight. He was always getting into fights. What kind of guy was Jake? Jake Rogers was a total creep. Nobody liked him. I gotta go now. Later. Hey, Nancy. Need something? Have you seen any of those weird messages on the bulletin boards? <sighs> Yes, and if I catch the guy who's doing it, he's going to be in big trouble. I bet it's the same person who keeps on setting off the soda machine alarm. I guess that comes with a territory of being a school monitor. Normally it's not this hectic. When I figure out who's been pulling all these pranks... Do you know Hal Tanaka? Not very well. He's an exchange student from Japan and a total workaholic. He told me he's trying to get more scholarships for college. Lately, he's been looking really burnt out. I think the pressure's getting to him. What pressure? I guess it's a big deal for his family that he get into a good school on a free ride. What do you know about Hulk Sanchez? He's a big jock on campus. Never dated him or anything. I'll talk to you later. Bye. The teacher's lounge is off limits. 